Explain like I'm five what is a reverse mortgage. You sell your house to the bank but they agree to let you live there rent free until you die. Be extremely careful of the fine print. It will include exactly what circumstances will allow them to kick you out before you die. You agree with a bank for them to lend you money based on your house as collateral. But with no intent to pay it back. Except by selling your house. Usually the house is sold when you die. Or when you move to a retirement home. They're for old people who can't afford their monthly expenses. Instead of dying and leaving a home to their heiress. They slowly sell it to the bank and use that money now. Upside is that someone can maintain their standard of living even after spending all of their savings. Downside is that their children will have a much smaller inheritance since they were selling off their biggest asset and spending it before death. If someone is considering AR mortgage, you may consider moving in together instead to save money and preserve their wealth. You're effectively selling off your home equity for cash in monthly installments. Loan is due at time of death no sooner unless there's a sale or a specific clause. Interest is compounded monthly based upon the amount of money in total that the bank has given you. Reverse mortgages are a bad idea and should only be used as a last resort. They can use some crazy eviction strategies that are within the limits of the contract. You just never know when that reputable company will sell your mortgage to some less scrupulous organization and now you are at their mercy. Pretty much same as normal mortgage but bank will take her property and sell it and pay off whatever you borrow. It's always higher interest than normal mortgages. Only do this if you ran out of options. With an ordinary mortgage, you borrow money and buy a house. Then pay monthly to pay off the debt. With a reverse mortgage, someone buys your house a bit at a time. Paying you monthly to be allowed to have your house when it is either paid off or you either die or go to a nursing home. They are tricky and you need to make certain you understand both the reverse mortgage and your long term needs. Sometimes they are a great way to use your house to fund your retirement. Other times they are a great way to lose your house in your twilight years. You give someone your house. How nice of you. They give you a couple bucks a month to make it feel like you are getting some magical deal. You eventually pass away. They keep the house you gave them. End of story. I see a reverse mortgage is slowly giving your house away. Another question is. Can you undo a reverse mortgage? Meaning, buy back the the amount you gave away so you can own 100 again. And if you can, you now probably have a mortgage again as an elderly person. The whole idea of a reverse mortgage sounds unscrupulous. The bank gives you money from the equity in your house. When you die, the bank either gets the money back from your estate or, if there's not enough without the house, they get and then sell the house. Did you just see the state? Grandma and Grandpa got tricked by some bad guys while watching Matlock reruns and now Daddy isn't talking to them. They charge you interest to buy your house. My mom got one and the interest rate has ballooned to 10. I have no idea how to help her get out from underneath at this point. A regular mortgage is buying a house in slow motion you pay the bank every month for a long time. And then you'll eventually own the house at the end. A reverse mortgage is selling a house in slow motion the bank pays you every month for a long time. And then the bank eventually owns the house at the end. First off I'd like to point out a reverse mortgage is basically a scam. The gist of it is they buy your home now. And they draw up a contract for you to live in it. Usually the offer they make is way under market. And the contract for you to live in the house is very one-sided to the point where many people are. Cheated out of their homes.